We'll get there. We'll get there. But in the meantime, we're going to play Heretic. We're going to have some fun. Let's start her up. Playing it on the GZ Doom engine. And like good old GZ Doom. All right. Get this on screen. Sometimes it takes a while for the game to load up on OBS. I don't know why. There it goes. A little bit of a delay. So where were we? I don't even remember. I don't. Did we beat the mausoleum? Oh, hold on. Where are we? This says E4 M9. How is that even possible? Last thing we played was the mausoleum. Oh my goodness, we must have gotten to the secret level. Usually the ninth level in every episode is reserved for a secret mission. This might be the first one we've gotten to. Uh, since starting playing through every episode. Every official episode. I didn't even realize it, so we're in E4M9. Look at that. Start that up. Why this is so difficult. Secret mission. Whatever they want to call it. We must have taken a secret way to here. Secret portal. We never left EM um, E4 map 4 correctly. We didn't take the obvious way out. Which I thought we were taking. Well, that's cool. Our first uh, secret map. Probably just this hard, though. Pump up the sound a little bit here. Hope it's not too loud. My voice is probably louder than anything. There we go. Alright, so what's the map here? Strange map. There's a yellow door back here, so... Gotta find the yellow key now. This weapon's pretty good for this level. I'm gonna go with it and stick with it as long as they keep having this ammo. Wow, this is just corridor after corridor. Let's go down this way, see what's there. So I ended the stream last time thinking this was E4, M5. Boy, was I surprised it wasn't. Pretty cool map layout. At least it has extra, like, easier enemies. Oh, somewhat. I jump up there. Probably a way for these walls to send into the ground. Ah. Really? Okay. Tons of enemies in this. Gonna take it slow. I guess the further out we branch, the harder and more difficult the enemies are. We gotta take out 
Easy ones first. Slowly branch out to the edges of the map. So many of them. Somehow we have more than a hundred health too. On what we picked up for now. No, we didn't have more than a hundred health. I'm sorry, I was looking at the, uh, the bullet count. Wait for the enemies to come to me. Zero of five secrets here. Okay, let's let's go look at the yellow door for a minute. Always gotta look behind you. That's the yellow door. Now this like so uneven. Probably because sounds are too high. Music isn't enough. There we go. Alright, so first things first, we gotta find the yellow key. That door. Probably go down this way. Just pick a corridor and follow it. Closed, and now it opened. Wait, did we just teleport? What the heck is going on in this level? Teleported through, maybe. Is that lick? Yeah, I don't know what just happened there. It like went dark, got light again. At least we picked up a torch. I feel like there's another lick out there. Yep. Defeat it. Stay alive. Stay alive. Oh my goodness, there's just all licks in here. I don't want to go inside that cage either. Tons of enemies. Ah, no! Oh. Where we die, right? Oh, he's down there. And there's another one. Better get the... the armor. Let's save this. Otherwise we're gonna have to start the whole level over again. the secret level secret map episode four no <laughs> I think I have the staff anymore you're just joining us we're in e4 m9 the extra mission map here we are Kill it. Yep. Oh, something big back there, too. Fire at us. Where? Gotta be like a invisible wall here, no? Of course not. Something happened there.
Try to beat him with conventional weapons. We killed it. Somehow we killed him. And we have corridors filled with enemies. That's what I need, the tome. All coming down from that one corridor. Wait, what? Sorry, something just came up on the phone. Take a look at it. Something soccer related, or shall I say football, because really what it is. Nice and slow here. Another lick on that side. Really. Came out of somewhere. There's one down that way, too. I'm afraid to go anywhere here. We still have one torch. Let's use it. See where we're going. Weapon's pretty much useless at this point. If I run out of ammo, that's what I'm gonna have to use, unfortunately. If I can kill everybody in that cage and then somehow jump in there, that'd be awesome. Oh! Get away from me. Must kill all enemies. How many of them? Ah. Thank God for that armor. Another one down. Look at all these dead monsters we have. I hear another lick. Ricked hit. Ah, oh, gotta get rid of that tornado. Blank him. Right into it. I would have thought killing them would have, like, stopped the tornado from attacking, but it still comes at you. Save this. Ah, the torch is running out. But we'll do our best here. Yeah. Try to kill everything that's in here. also five secrets of which we have yet to find one 143 enemies i think the whole southern part of the map we haven't gone through yet why 
do I... See how you hear them? Like, right here? I feel like there's an invisible wall. Possibly. Why would I be hearing them? Looks like there's an invisible staircase in here, too. Here. Is there a little cutout here? We're hearing these guys in here. That's what I think we're hearing. Another one. There's a teleporter in there. If we can teleport in there, there's plenty of goodies, probably. I'll take out the enemies now. Uh, I don't really see too much in there. There we go. Another one down. I think that was the last one. switch in there. I gotta find the teleporter to get it to the switch. We still need to find the yellow key as well. There's a staircase hidden there. Get to that. Go south. There we go. Not as a secret, of course not. Does it? Nope. I think it's secret enough. Oh, that's the way up there so you can go across and get all those items. That's it. Missed a couple. Gotta do it again. That's opened. Hearing enemies, but I'm no longer seeing them. We killed the vast majority of the ones in this area, so where are the rest? See those white bars? You probably can't see them screen very well. This map is very not, like, well drawn. Like, I mean, it's well drawn. It, it, it could have made the line sticker on it. Trying desperately to find this staircase. The other side of this wall. You gotta teleport into it, maybe? Like, right there. to teleport into it. Still no yolo key. Upper right. We didn't do the upper right side. Save this. Upper right seems to be the only place we haven't gone. In case we see a lit. I 
love their flying s flaming skulls. That's it. Nobody else here. Missing everything. Oh, snap. Hide. Shoot. Went to hide behind a corner. Of course, I did not see that. against them. Visibility? Why not? Alright, he's dead. Good. Now what? Gotta figure out a way into the center there. That platform. whole part of this map we haven't even seen yet. There's at least 70 enemies, well, close to 70 still on the map. Try to make our way in. I don't think hitting a switch or anything. I'm just trying this out. See if we can get inside somehow. Yeah, I don't know how to get inside. It has to be right there. There's a little divot. Why would there be a divot? Item back there. That's got to be the way in. Still no yellow key. I mean, that might lead us to something. And then we have the staircase we can't get into. Use the map. Travel back to a certain point. It's just easier with the map. Faster. Here. I'm hearing enemies. There's got to be a way inside one of these walls. Like, this has to be a door or something, right? Door and... So what though? I have no idea. Something behind this wall. An enemy. Explored everything we could explore so far. Where could there be a secret? Starting area, maybe? start in this level. Let's go here. A little is nothing. 
What happens if I hit that switch? Can it be hit? Yeah, I'm gonna make a precise shot in there. Especially from here. There, we got it in there. It did nothing. Wow, we're really trapped here. I don't know what to do next. Nothing in here. I thought that this was a nicely designed level in and in that. Gotta be a secret door or something here. Hey Braxton, how's it going? Thank you for the host. You had a good Memorial Day. Memorial Day weekend. So we are in the secret level of episode four. I thought this was E4M5. It is not. It is E4M9. Can't figure a way through it. I have to hear you're good. Really, they just don't know. Gonna be something stupid too. It's like, oh, it was right here all along. Need a yellow key, but there's no yellow key anywhere. Just looking around for secret doors, something hidden, something to open. Maybe there's a secret here. Don't ask me why I think that. Anything's a possibility at this point. Wait. Hang along that wall. Wait, is there... Is there something up there? No, just my imagination. I thought maybe there might have been a door up here somewhere. to look it up for a hint. I've checked everywhere I think a door would could exist. Found absolutely nothing so far. I hear you enemies, I just don't know where to go. Like, if there's gonna be a secret door, wouldn't you think this is it? Especially since the skull has those blue squiggly lines on top of it. A little bit different from the others that we've seen. Heard them. I think there's licks in there. But at one point we passed through a teleporter. Teleport portal. I. Do you need one to get in there? gonna have to figure this out 
I mean, why would they... I mean, I'm looking to see how to get in there, but it's definitely the portal that gets you in there. Why else would they put a portal in there? I'm like looking for the secret door switch on the outside or something. That's not a door. Alright. We need help. Hang on. E4, M9. Secret level. Mausoleum. Either you're going to tell me where the door is, or you're going to tell me where the key is, because there's no other way. Four more alcoves will open. Ow. You check the wall on either side. Get a useful hint. Go to the southwestern border of the map and find the place where you can see wooden platforms with ammo and items in them. You check the wall to the right of the left of the platforms, you'll notice carvings showing a demon with green eyes. Those are actually hitting doors. Okay, so it's the demon with green eyes. Those are the doors we need. We know. They have this. I like Heretic. A lot of fun. Southwestern, all the way down here. Green eyes. But something about skulls with green eyes over here. This. Oh, backpack. Carry more. Skulls with green eyes is all the hints I need. I don't recall playing it before. Yeah, this is basically the secret map. When we left map 4, episode 4, we must have taken an alternate route out. Not that I realized it. See how he's got red eyes? We're looking for ones with green eyes. He's red. I'll find it. So, I don't know where you go after this. I think you just leave the entire episode, maybe? But, red. Means episode four, map four, wasn't fully explored, if that's the case. That's fine by me. I'm not trying to 100% this game. I'm trying to veto every map. Where'd the skull with the green eyes go? Got yeah, red. Green eyes? Anywhere? An ending is an ending, I always say. Yep. And a reason to play it again if you really like the game. Supposed to be three skulls with green eyes. Supposed to be a hint on how to advance, but who knows where they are. Red. Great. Go left. Skull right there. Which 
Which the light would stop flickering, actually. There's gotta be a portal here somewhere. Come on. Or a door. Secret door. You gotta have red eyes for it. Lord. Lord. Get out of here. Back here again on the outside. Go down. Up and down every corridor. Make sure we haven't missed anything. red, right? I mean, do they have to have green eyes? I'm wondering now. Basically lied to. I haven't found any of them. Inside. This guide may have been written by someone who was colorblind. That's what I think. Because every big skull has red eyes, and I'm not seeing anything green. You're supposed to see green on some of the smaller ones, which tell you, hey, there's a door here, but... Like, why wouldn't this be a door? Wait, where did he come from? But I killed everybody in there. Must have teleported himself in there by accident. What else does he have to say? Because close the window too. Browser window. Mausoleum. 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 Mus. Looks quiet. You can explore the corridors. Why are there no doors in this place? There are several locations where there should be doors, but they are only sculpted walls that appear to be stuck. The auto map marks some of these walls as doors, but no matter how much you try, they are closed and there's no way to get inside. I've been trying that all game, all stream. To get a useful hint, go to the southwestern border of the map, find a place where you can see wooden platforms with ammo and items on them. If you check the wall on either the right or left of the platforms, you'll notice carvings showing a demon with green eyes. There are actually hidden doors that you can open. A demon with green eyes. Go back to that spot. My prediction will be that it's some stupid spot that makes you face palm when you find it. I totally agree with that prediction. So I'm starting to feel here. Okay, so where are the platforms? They're all the way down to the southwest. Where are these carvings they speak of? Could be a carving here. These are the platforms with the items on them. Every game you play? That happens to me too. I'm not very good with directions, I think. Oh, you'll find the carvings, and then you'll see them in the wall, and, and they'll tell you where to go, and all will be right in life, and health and happiness, and all that BS carvings. There are no carvings here.
The only wall carvings I could tell you or exist are at the beginning of the level. Something behind this wall, I could hear it growling. Come on, we've been through every inch of this map. Go back to the start. Right now and then I think I might see something that's green, but I don't. Nice playing trick on me. Okay, beginning is right here. These carvings, these look like carvings. I'm assuming what I'm looking for is one of these. Guess not. Okay, back to the south of us. Let's let's just start there. The safe FAQ walkthrough is completely wrong. Make our way through here. could hear the enemy right here. Monster, whatever it is. Probably a lick. But something about stone carving. Is there none or wood carvings or something? Nothing here. Green eyes. I don't see anything with green eyes. One consolation is we have a map. Yeah, but the problem is, is we've been through everywhere on the map except for that area, the blue box. It has a portal in it, and then that staircase to the left. And there's a yellow key somewhere in this map. Check this out again. I, I'm not believing this. Many locations there's stuff. Many locations. Notice carving showing the demon with green eyes. Taking the goodies. Southwestern border of the app, where you can see wooden platforms and ammo items on them. Check the wall on either the right or left side. You'll notice carving showing a demon with green eyes. Come on. We're not anywhere near there. In this. I can't alt tab for some reason. All my screens. Putting chat. The map doesn't even have that complicated. It isn't even that complicated. How is it so well hidden? It's hidden in plain sight. That's what I think it is. It definitely is. I keep going back to the spot where he says there's carvings with, with green eyes, but... we see any? No, of course not. Carvings with green eyes. here seems to have green eyes. Maybe it's the little carvings I should be looking for, not the big ones, but the red eyes. 
we've found, like those styles. That would be face palm worthy, yep. Frick, because none of these. I bet you there's no way out of here. That's why it's a secret level. You're gonna have to restart the whole entire thing. They're like, there's so many secrets here. I do not see any green eyes on any of these. That should have a green eye, right? Red. Okay. Of course, it doesn't open. Oh, yeah. Then I have to look it up again, get a better FAQ or something. <laughs> Show me a picture of what they look like in the walkthrough. The fancy walkthrough. Fandom wiki, I think. Usually they have good pictures. Well, she's playing a different version of the game than we are. Retail copy or something? This is the God version? Maybe that's the issue? No idea. Mess up my configuration, dude. Come on, they gotta be in plain sight if they got green eyes. They're hidden in plain sight. That's what I'm trying to say. Walkthrough route really should include screenshots for some of the stuff. Written description is too subjective. Yeah. Especially when you're trying to look up like a certain location and they're basically giving directions as if you read the entire walkthrough. In the meantime, you're just skimming over it because only a certain part you need to see. This. Anything? Little door. Invisible doors could be anywhere. The way we started. Started from that point. Notice carvings showing a demon with green eyes. They are actually hidden doors. The area behind doesn't count as a secret. Taking the goodies, you have to find the only other place with the same carving in the whole lot of all. It's found just west of the starting point. Great way to just ruin the game by... I wish there was an easier... Way to figure this out so that we have to give ourselves the uh no don't want to quit just ruined spoiled the game for us so where's the opening we're right by the beginning we need to go west of the beginning i'm gonna go directly west Same carvings as they are on the other side. I don't see this. Or as west as can be. But at a point where you see the same carvings, I. Go in here. 
No, we did. Might help if I had a torch. You know what? I hate myself for doing this, but see if this helps. It's ability. At least we could see everything. Not blinking. Uh, no, I don't. Find a different walkthrough because this is ridiculous strategy wiki. Isn't that what we were just in? The first sector from the west. E4, M9. Three teleporters. Long stairways, so sectors. You're now ready to begin the main task. If you look at the auto map, you'll see the corridors divided into level. The level into sectors. Each one of these has some sort of room or rooms, area chambers, each inside with a different theme. Probably saw doors loading, leading to some sectors. One sector has windows, one has ledges out of reach. Only overall objective is to find the yellow key. Your path to the yellow key will involve visiting almost all of these three sectors. Some of them several times. Unrelated bonus sector is available at any time. Narrow one to the southwest of the wood paneled ledges. At each of the next south walls are the textures that are slightly different. These are hidden doors inside. Southwest again, it's telling me to go to. At least there's no enemies, we killed them all. Always look at the bright side. I feel like I already opened these doors, and that's all that's here, but... Probably telling me to open these doors. I'm gonna take a break in about 10 minutes, but we've really gotten nowhere here. Through the third sector from the west along the outermost corridor and activate the sector of wall on the north side that's slightly different to a door. Maybe we're in the wrong spot. That's all I can say. Saying third sector. I don't know why he's talking in sectors. Because this is not how this map is really. Let's say one, two, three, four. Go back this way. What do we got to lose? Anything different? Anything out of place here? Killing me here. 
Oh, the heck with it. I hate looking stuff up in games like this. Midpoint of which is yellow door. Me sneaking up on you. I saw that. That's it. There's no more. Oh, there's a map here. Is this a map of this? E4 M9 map. We got a map. That's good. Wow. Okay. I think I see where one of the hidden doors are, possibly. Al, that's a hidden door is beyond me. That's what this map says. Let's look. Down this way. Look, any progress is good progress, whether you use a walkthrough or not. I mean, at this point, you have to. five hours trying to make your way out of this thing. So this says there's a door here. I don't know... I'm supposed to get to it from the inside? I mean, clearly this looks like a door. And there's also something here. There's a staircase behind this. Staircase is on the map. I almost always have a walkthrough ready it's when I stream. Yeah, I... I don't mind using a walkthrough, especially if you're super, super stuck. I usually don't keep one handy, but I should. I should learn my lesson with this episode of the game, because it's just so hard. Sometimes you have to look it up in advance and get the gameplay. Yep, yeah, no one wants to watch me meander, wander for hours. I feel the same way too. I feel like if I spend more than 15, 20 minutes in an area. So I can't go in there because th there's a way out through that door with the red eyes. That's the way out, according to this. By the entrance, there's something by the entrance. Probably a teleportation. All right, I got to take a quick break. And then we're going to get out of here. Just give me a minute. I'll be right back.
All right, so I believe there was a door, a secret door that we might have missed over by the start of the map. Right here. There we go. There was a carving that was somewhat different there. Oh my goodness. This probably offers me nothing. Maybe like an item or something. Just wow, yeah. You know what, I couldn't... I had to look at the map. You see how this room is blinking on and off? You can't see anything on the wall unless you have a torch. It couldn't have made it any more difficult. And there's a switch back there. And we're about to die, trying to get this thing. I think I saved it. Alright. Do not go for the backpack. Still oh, got it. Okay, what did the switch open up? So not only did they do this to me, where I couldn't find anything, but whatever markings were on the door, I could not see whatsoever. Because everything's just pitch black here. Let's stay along the top here. I feel like there should be some kind of door here. I wish I would have seen that marking before I accidentally tripped it. Because then I would be clear about what needed to be opened. That's not even considered a secret where we were just in. Consider part of the level. This doesn't mark it on the map as a secret. Just like, why would they do this? This is not even a difficulty thing. It's it's just that it's. Oh. Oh, we opened this area up with the teleporter. That's what the switch opened. Okay. Where am I now? Oh god, there's all enemies here. I can't see them. All gargoyles. That's a door. The door out. No! Really? Why does anybody want these time bombs? They're they're useless, I, I feel. You open the door and then you realize it's completely like nothing there. What? this right here? There's like a little staircase in there. How do we get in there? This is the staircase with the portal. Gotta be something else in here. Can't just be all these time bomb traps. That goes outside. Frustrating. Nice, 
complete frustration. Nothing here. I don't useless items. So everything in this direction has to have a hidden door. Trying to do this without the map, but I'm gonna have to go back to the map, I think. The little green eyes thing was like wrong, I think. Looking for different carvings on a wall. not see any different carvings. That map helped more than any of those other walkthroughs. Let's have a longer look. Um, oh. Another place that looks like a door south of where we are. There. I mean, clearly that looks like a door. A little niche in the wall. Uh, I'm spending the whole time just looking stuff up. Why? Um... My thing is, there's some doors here, but secret doors won't open for me. There's one on the side there, but I think it's a door that only opens from the inside. Yeah, I'm making about as much sense as these walkthroughs right now, but... Like, this is a cool map. It started out as a cool one, but then, like... Here. This is the door, but it only goes out. It doesn't go in. And with this one. I don't see any other doors here. Right here, there should be a door right here that opens. This thing. But it only opens from the inside. Even though on the map it's marked like an outside door. Completely lost. I'm gonna lose my love here for this game. And I literally have to scour every dark corner corridor. See if I find the missing hidden door. Find a teleporter that leads to nowhere.
Oh, I see where we gotta go. Look at this. Oh, I thought we had to go that way in the center. We don't. Let's do this again. That opens up a staircase for us right here. Takes us here. This room offers absolutely nothing. This opens up, takes us outside. We did get this to- oh, there's a second teleport. Why didn't I see that? Okay, now we know where we're, where we're going. We're making some progress here. Stay alive. Stay alive in the center. Which opens up everything else. How do I get up there now? Oh, not these guys. The arrows. Auto saving. Gum saving. What we can really do here. Now we're opening all these secret areas. That opened up another door. What? I'm confused. Why is it keeping me from the center now? Oh. This bill does not take me in there. Can't get back in here, can I? No, I can't. Can't do that trick again. What's over here? Okay, being in here lowers everything in the middle. Here, you know what? Right here is gonna be a secret wall. Come on. Yeah, they give you a chance to walk right in there. There's like a cutout there on the other side. They want you to go that way.
Oh goodness. If I stand on the wall, would it push me upwards? Is that what I need to do? Okay, now I'm on top of the wall. Nothing here. I hate this map. I really do. back to the other map. Hang on. I fixed something with my camera, but camera's not working right. There's something wrong on the stream. Okay, so that's fine. Talking screen is not fine. Change scene, it apparently resets the color. Okay, that should do it. There we go. Now we're missing the game. There it is. Okay, back to the map. This map is our savior. So basically, you just run around here and... Touch every wall so you actually find the secrets. I have a general idea of where the secret spot may be because the map is telling me that. There's stuff in these walls. I know that. This needs to open at some point. It's a door. Hey, whoever said these skulls need green eyes? Probably colorblind, I hate to say it. No offense to people who are colorblind. I've known many people who are and they've gotten along well with being colorblind. They're able to overcome their disability, but um, that's me putting my foot in my mouth. I'm just trying to figure out the logic behind this stupid map. This is a door open. Makes me think of level this one level in Wolfenstein 3D where everything was a secret. I think there were over 100 secrets out in that level. Oh my god. I think I just saw somebody play that too. It's not even about the secrets. We haven't even found the secrets yet. You think these were secrets or not? Some doors open, some doors don't. Some are going to need switches, others won't. Some of these doors open from the inside, some of them open from the outside. Like that one right there opens from the outside. The, the inside, I mean. Now I have no clue. Some of these switches have been tripped. I thought maybe there's a way to just stand in the middle of the platform and survive, but there isn't. All progress. Everything was behind the secret. 
There's a lot in this game that should not be a secret that actually is a secret. Like, you shouldn't have a secret part of a level that's mandatory to completing that level. It's not a secret then. It's just you having to go through something all over again. You know what? There's a third portal here. I just haven't found it yet. Hold on. Boom. Progress. Look at this. Yeah, put all the good stuff in the lava. Why don't you? Now this door won't open. Funny. Oh, switch. Okay. What did that switch do? Because I can't leave here yet. Yeah, there is a difference between a hidden and a secret, but this seems to not differentiate between the two. Especially on some of the earlier levels, it was like, you know, it literally marked it as a secret, I thought. On the map. I could have sworn it did. Yet it was an area that you needed to complete the level with. something in the middle there now I'm having trouble getting out of here the other is that brick in the middle hell it's got an outline on it Was this that was in there? That had to have opened something else. Oh, open this up. Can't go up, go down. All right, we're making some progress. I missed the portal on me. and there's a door out. Portal here. A switch, too? Like, come on. How many things are you gonna have in here? I really had armor. Wish I would have saved before I got into the lava. There's stuff we missed in there, too. Funny. Have to go back in there. Any health left? Probably use it all. 
Oh, there's health here. What do we do? We went down. Can't go... Can we go this way? Let's go this way. Stairs. What was behind me? Nope, it didn't. Doesn't open up anything. No, there has to be an opening here. This can't be a dead end. On every tick. There it is. Platforming, my favorite thing to do. First person shooter. Put an enemy at the far end, trying to kill me. Probably gonna knock me off or something. Jesus! Ugh, let's get out of here. I don't know what we missed up there, but... Making progress. Do this again, just to make sure we don't miss anything important. Yeah, he got it. No matter what, I can't make it across here. I suck at platforming in a first person setting. I'm gonna have to just do this. I have to bite the bullet and just do my best here and try to get across. A little health as I have. Actually, you know what? Let's. Oh, we got 10 potions. Why didn't I. In case we need them. Really? We're gonna start from that point anyway. Before we ran across, the mage is there. Here are the gargoyle. Hey, he's gone. Got him. Save it now. I bet you I make it across and there's like nothing worthwhile there. Gonna try to run it all. 
they've scummed the way across. Oh, you could just run across for that wand. Oh, we finally revealed the secret. Even though it was just basically part of that room. We didn't do anything to reveal the secret. We just walked in and the walls came out. The DLC for Heretic didn't really get, like, reviews or anything good said about it. I could understand why. The layout. Okay. It's not great. It kicks your ass, and it defies the logic of the rest of the game, base game. It. Anywhere you see a blue banner. Oh yeah. Did we hit any switches? There was a portal in there we never used. We went to the secret room. These other areas that are blank in the middle, that's where we need to go. Spent an hour and a half on this map. We're gonna be playing this on Thursday. I was like, maybe we'll start episode five. Maybe we'll just play something else in the meantime. Like, I don't know if this ends with this level. Now, mission, whatever. What? Bonus one. I don't know if it brings you back to four, it takes you to five. Let's have a look around this area. Something opened up here. That's gotta be opened. And we have this part right here that doesn't have a door. Missed an item or two in there. Back here. We went through the three portals. They say you're going to do a lot of backtracking here, and I believe them. I don't know where I've been to. Secret mission map. Call them missions. The M stands for map. Uh, not like there's a switch. Into the secret room. I teleport out of here just to see what I can, but. Probably easiest to do that to get out. Go through the three teleporters that are on the other side. Way. Backtrack.
probably no way to figure this out. I backtrack just to try it. At some point, you gotta get the yellow key. That goes here. This is useless. Try the second one again. Takes me here. We gotta get out of this map. We're spending way too much time here. Half the stream just on this map. I understand this is supposed to be super difficult, but... Look at the map I found. I wish I wouldn't have found the secret exit here. There are some rooms in that area. Let's go find them. Looks like a couple of rooms. Yeah, I see him. That first column right there, that area of rooms. Go back there. Might be a switch I missed in there. Get out of there. Here. There's certainly stuff I missed in there. Secret door. Okay. Well, we get extra health. There's another secret there, too. Why would you fly in this level? There's nowhere to fly out of. Everything's on one... One level, it looks like. Feels like. No, I need to continue right now. I do. This time we go right. There's a secret. A secret that has nothing but a potion in it. There's one more to go. On this side, it's a teleport. Nope, it's a secret. All to get this, which I didn't really need. bit of a waste, but I completed this part now. There's gotta be more to this room, no? Why would it bring you back here?
Now let's look at the map one more time. Oh, um, there, upper right. Something in the upper right, isn't there? I don't know if it opened up though. Yeah, start a new game. Why not? That's nothing. Search from. Once you get the yellow key, I think you're out of this area. Once and for all. One walkthrough was completely wrong. It said, look for the skulls of the green eyes. There are no green eyes. Jackson was right about that. Not seeing any. Not just me. Can we go back in here for a minute? I think I might have missed something on the corners. Like something's supposed to open here. But it doesn't. Oh, uh, this is frustrating. Came in here for that switch. There shouldn't be anything else. I was wondering maybe they hit a switch in here. That would really suck if they did. Have to look. Really have to look there. Eighteen more enemies and another secret to go here. Portal I'm missing, something, a switch, I don't see anything. This door either opens or... From the outside or it opens from the inside, probably the inside. But we do need to get in there. I bet you there's a portal into this room. That's got to open. I mean, they show you where the switches are, more or less. Probably, I don't know. See a couple of them.
two maps. It doesn't show you the doors, the other one does. This map is not any good. It's hard to use a walkthrough for a first person shooter. That would have been insidious, yep. Completely. See, there's two areas here we need to get into. This doesn't do anything here. For bringing me back to the lava. We uncovered all the secrets, too. Third one? No, there's secrets in here. Just don't know anymore. Just these two areas right here we can't get into. Is there an explanation for this? This is so painful. I really hope it's the end of the episode once we get out of here. Turn to the long stairways sector. Which in the window sector I'm blocked the stairs leading up? Far side, you'll find the third stairway leading down. There's nothing so far. Center staircase where teleporter leads you to. Here. Something. Get out of here. I don't want it to take another two hours to do that. It's on this side. We missed this? I think we did. There we go. In progress, finally. Wow. It's not a door. There should be a secret here. A door. The fake secret. Nothing better than a fake secret, right? 
Oh, look at this. All the doors are opening. Or the walls, rather. And... Is this real? Or is this gonna kill me? No, it's not. There's the yellow key. Alright, we made progress. Probably beat this now. else opened? Maybe in the center here? They go in here, I think. If even. Hey, that still stayed closed. That could be the secret for all I know. The real secret. Not the fake one. We already have the yellow key, so who cares? Get out of here. Right? Has to be the way out, right? Here we go. Yeah, now they give you the entire map. I just heard something open too, I think. Teleport? Station platform up there? A platform? A teleporter? I don't know what you want to call it. How do we get up there? That's how we get up there. Wow, okay, so way out. Finally. We missed the one enemy. We missed one secret. We missed eight items. Hour eighteen minutes. Which in actuality was two hours. Well under two hours. In real time. Yes, we did it. Thankfully. That was torture. Next. Now entering Great Stair. So what the heck is Great Stair? E4, M5. It takes us back there. So we gotta, we're got we not even done with this yet. Because we did the secret. Hopefully this will be a lot easier. That's where I thought we were originally. And we ended up there. E4, E9, M9. Wow. Yeah, we did it. I just can't believe I had to go through all that. Now we're in a room with no way out. Word. Where's the secret? This lets us out to the actual level. There's something big in here, too. Minotaur. But oh, you're me health. So many of these things here. They're not Minotaurs. Those would have been the worst. <laughs> They're killable. As long as you don't kill yourself in the process.
for the night. Forget it. That's a bad spot to try and kill him. side. The only way out is through that door. This one. I'm missing a switch. Yes, I am. switch here? No, there isn't. Oh, I see what we opened up. We opened this up. everybody on that side of this. Got him. Good, we're still alive somehow. That's where we use the yellow key. I do not have the yellow key. Took me like five tries to hit him. Finally hit him. There's the yellow key. Something in here has to open it to lower that platform so I can get the yellow key. Get a raid. Emilio, thank you for the raid. Welcome. How are you? How was Wolfenstein? Can you dig it? Can you dig it? And I'll watch it tomorrow on VOD. Working from home. Thank you for the raid. Welcome, raiders. We are having a sick ass time right now playing the DLC, episode four of Heretic. Duke! Not Wolf, I'm sorry. Duke Nukem. My bad. I'm in a very Wolfenstein kind of mood right now. Especially since I watched. Um, Preacher play it not too long ago. It's actually very good. Is it a well polished, um, like, I guess I would call it demo or alpha or something? I was enjoying it even if it's broken unfinished. Cool. 
I'll definitely watch the VOD then. I want to see what it looks like. I mean, what would it take for modders to actually try to finish it? Need the key. It is not polished. No, it's barely a game. Okay. So there's not much to work on. What stair is decent? Cool. I have to go to center here, possibly. Lots of work, but I believe it's possible. There you go. Somebody will do it in their spare time at some point. This game, the DLC though, it's been kicking my butt. What? No, my internet, it's going to finish it. Your internet? Are you still having internet problems? Oh, you mean the internet in general? Somebody's gonna finish that game. Yeah. You could play like a wad of it or something. Hold on, let me drink some water. even bother to save since we got here? Yeah, two minutes in. Okay. Big deal. Ugh, we're so far behind now. Switch here. Got him. There's one more around. Yeah, we ended up in the secret level here. We ended up in E4M9. Now we're in E4M5. Somehow I found a way to it. And that was, like, ridiculously hard. It was just a maze and secret doors, and they don't really tell you how to get access to them. Even the FAQ I looked at to get started on the which door and which direction to go in was horrible. Like, told me to look for green skulls and, or green eyes on skulls and there weren't on... I don't know what version of the game they were playing. Thinking at some point, possibly towards the end of the summer, early fall or whatever, like, I want to organize a four player Diablo. Diablo, like, playthrough. I can get everybody to agree to be online when I'm online.
There are mods available that'll allow you to play with four players still. To do something multiplayer wise. There's a staircase back there we missed. I like the original Diablo. I like it better than the second one. This had something to it, but the second one kind of you know, expanded on a lot, but still. We do this. We need to get the third level. I don't have the key. To bring this down. There's gotta be a switch. Oh yeah, that's right. We went through the center here. Once we went into that portal, that's how we died, I think. Been ages since I played Diablo. No, no! Died again. the door right here wait what this is before I flip the switch isn't it it means I shouldn't be in here There was a switch up here. Not. You know what? Let's use the ring. It's gonna help us pass this part and make some more progress because otherwise we'll be playing forever. We got rid of them. Progress is progress. Save this. 26 of 65 enemies. I thought that's where the key was. Oh, we have the key already. I didn't realize it. back to the beginning so let's go to where we can actually use this key yellow door I don't like this gun against the uh, gargoyles
Wow. All right. Shooting at him. No. Stupid. That was stupid of me. Go use that yellow door. Save it right outside the yellow door. to have in this situation. I got stuck with it though. Come to us. I can't just keep running in there because it's gonna reveal all the other ones that are there. forgot to shout out Camilio. Definitely have to give him a shout out. Playing Duke Nukem Forever, the long lost unfinished Duke Nukem game. Early 2000s. Appreciate the raid. Welcome people from his channel. If you're not following him. I can just go in his ass. I can go in his ass. I can go in his ass! I don't know what that was. I think it might have been Mech Warrior. <laughs> Maybe like Mech Warrior 4. But um, definitely give Camellio a follow, especially if you like retro games. He's also a big uh, Battletech fan. I'm playing Battletech. Well. How are there no enemies up here? They were shooting me the entire time I was down there. Maybe I just killed them all somehow? This should be a way I kill them. But it's not. Nothing behind it. Coffee break. Enjoy your coffee. They said if you drink three cups of coffee, no matter how you drink it, you'll live longer. That's what they said on the news today. I don't know how much I believe that, but... Okay. Hey. 
green key. We have yet to find the green door, though. No, the monsters. They're on coffee break. Oh, okay. Got it. I thought you were taking a coffee break. Sorry, I misunderstood. Something keeps opening up, but there's no green door. Staircase on this side? I wasn't there before, right? Oh. There's a green door. Coffee for me after 5 p.m. No coffee. Got it. I stick to decaf there, so. And mainly one cup a day. Yeah, I don't blame you. Once you have coffee after 5 p.m., then you're basically setting yourself up not to fall asleep. I mix decaf and regular, so you have it mixed. Okay. When I usually get it outside, I have no choice. Most of the coffee shops here do not even offer decaf. They don't even make decaf. Because basically nobody ever buys decaf except for me. Like, if I ask for decaf coffee, that means I'm gonna have to probably wait a good 10 minutes until they serve everybody else so they can make me a special cup of decaf. Only place I can get decaf here is Dunkin' Donuts. I get a decaf cappuccino, but that's because they make it on the spot. It's not like they brew a pot of cappuccino. Everyone is anti-decaf. It sucks because there are so few good brands of decaf. I know. Absolutely no. Like, I like the coffee shop I go to in the morning. If I call ahead, they'll make me a cup of decaf, but... I just asked for a decaf cappuccino. The problem is, it's like twice the price of a regular cup of coffee. If I get some kind of breakfast item with that, I'm spending over $10. Ridiculous. I can't have the coffee at work, because they have... Green Mountain Coffee, which i pretty much allergic to. <laughs> hey Synergy, how's it going? I switched to only decaf. Yeah, when, it, when I make coffee at home, it's only decaf. Blue key is needed. Where's the green door? For coffee, not tea, yeah. Yeah, it's been a while. How are you doing? Oh, no problem. Same here. I'm actually next week going to stop streaming again for at least a month or so. Um, still working on that move <laughs> on that house. I'm getting there. You're doing well, though. And yeah, real life stuff comes up. It's, it's not a... It's all good been lurking here and there I know we've got a little delayed yeah but it'll be worth it in the end a lot of work so now I need a blue key Did I miss the switch up there Good luck. Sounds like you like me. You'd be, you'll be like me and moving during the hottest days. I hope not. We're gonna get movers. There's no way we could do this without movers. I hate moving in the heat, but the idea was to have moved before June first. And just we're not there yet. We're not there yet. Paint is almost done, the floors are almost done. We're like 75% there. 
0.9% on the HVAC. We'll be there before you know it. Yeah, I don't know what makes me allergic to Green Mountain coffee, but I went on a trip once to Disney World. And we took Amtrak there, which was interesting enough. And I kept getting migraine headaches and I couldn't figure out why. And then I put two and two together though, it was the coffee because Amtrak serves Green Mountain coffee. Disney serves Green Mountain coffee. There's the blue key. Now we get out of here. And once I stopped drinking their coffee, it was Green Mountain, I was fine. No migraine headaches. What? Movies are 100% worth the cost. We moved into a house in July and would have died if we had to haul things ourselves. Yeah, I, I agree with the movers. I applied for a database job at Green Mountain years back. Never heard back anything. No, nothing against the company. I mean, I'm sorry I didn't call you back. That's first and foremost, but... There's just something in their coffee that makes me sick. I have known allergies to stuff like coffee, like, not coffee, but like red wine, chocolate. I can't eat chocolate. Gives me all migraine headaches. Kind of sucks, but... <laughs> Ever had their coffee? Maybe they knew. Could be. It's good coffee. It's not bad coffee. It's just... It is what it is. Am I supposed to go this way? Turn right. Come in here. Raise up. That's the green key. Go through here. The green door is there. Blue key's coming up. Alright, we should definitely save this now. Favorite brand of coffee dough is Lavazza. Just love the taste of their coffee. Oh, wrong way. up the staircase on this side. Then through the green door. Wait, how is he still alive, this monster? I spent this whole stream and we did two missions. We're not done yet. I want to see if I can do one more. Two maps. That's what I mean. I gotta stop calling them missions. They're actually maps.
Oh, this is annoying. Got him. That opens the door where the blue key is. Let's get the blue key and let's get out of here. Back here somewhere. It's right here. Yep. Do this. I'm gonna play one more mission. Map. Night. Where we got killed. backtracking in this. This DLC content really kicks your butt. I get it. They wanted to make it as difficult as possible. That's why I got bad reviews. Still heading the wrong way. We gotta go back. This time I'm gonna save it. So we don't have to keep Doing this round of round. Be in the right direction all the time. Green door. Green keys had. There's a big guy in here. Still. But there was. We might have killed him at this point. I can get one more map in. We're gonna stream Thursday. I'm still up in the air about streaming Sunday. I'll let everybody know. When I do. The idea is to finally fully finish our game here. It means I gotta do episode 5, which is even harder than this. So. Might just call it if we can't beat it by Sunday, because after Sunday, that's it for a couple of months. A month and a half, maybe. Yeah. Gotta finish packing. It's like 90 here today, and then tomorrow it's going to go down to the early, to the low um, 70s and in the early mornings, and it's just going to stay there all day. Weather is strange. Oh, stop already with the tornadoes. Why not use the weakest weapon against them? Now we have the key. The ability to pick up the key. Save. Now I'm gonna use I'm gonna use invincibility if we have it. We do.
how we're gonna get through this. There he is. They come. dead. Stay alive. Why I went in there. Finding a nasty sore throat. Tests have been negative for COVID so far. Good. I'm glad to hear that. Someone was telling me that they had COVID and they took all the home tests. And even though the home tests were negative, they actually went to get a PCR test and it came back positive. They were telling me like not to believe the home tests. I don't know how accurate that. Maybe it just took a while for longer for it to matter. Okay, end of the game is right here. Or end of the map. Try one more. Definitely feel better, Synergy. That did not take us 14 minutes. Did a nose swab one? It seems like it could be up to how well you use it. True. True. They go in a lot deeper with the PCR. I can't believe we got past this. This was annoying. Yeah, if you go in further, like they do when they give you the PCR test, you're going to get a better result. I think. Goodness, we survived that. Somehow we survived it. That gives us armor. We don't have the yellow key, so go this way. I need to use the elevator again. On a happier note, I saw the video card prices are still trending down. That's good. 
That's cute. I'm gonna wait for like the end of the year and see if there's a sale. And I'm gonna pick up a system with a 3080. And that should be more than enough. If I can afford it, I'll do it. 3080 Ti. That'll be enough to run games for a long time. I don't need RTX. Care less about it. Just want to be able to play like Hellblade 2. A few other games. Otherwise, it's get an Xbox One, and I really don't want to do. Finished them off really quick. Unless anything happens to reverse the trend, I think waiting until the end of the year is a good plan. I agree. Completely agree. I mean, there's only a handful of games that would play with it. I'd still stream retro for the most part in indie games. What I enjoy right now. There has to be something beyond this. Where is it? Uh, I gotta jump down to the lava. There, it's a portal. Takes me back here. I don't understand that. Yeah, I think I'm pretty content for now playing the games I have. The system's good enough for that. When there's something I really, really want, then I'll have a to play, and I can't play it, then I really have a uh, motivation to buy a new system. Hey, Zero Dine, how's it going? Getting our butts kicked here. How have you been? I got me out of there. Another lick. <laughs> Having some days off? Nice. No, we we haven't moved yet. Actually, I'm gonna stop streaming starting next week just so I could spend time continuing the pack and stuff like that. We'll get there, though. We'll get there. There's a green key. Save it here. I hope you're enjoying your days off. Vacation time. I supposed to get out of here now? Like I'm stuck. I'm soft locked because I'm down here and there's no way to no way out. Key. 
this tier one sub emote, but it isn't. Yay, dude. doors on that side. Got the green key, so now I can go through the green door. Green door is up there. How do I get up to it? Seems to have like some kind of uh like party shirt on. Go for a ride. to jump there. That's where I think the green door is. There we are. It also has a Halloween costume and a Santa outfit. I think I remember the Santa outfit. Did you have that one up already? Maybe I'm dreaming. Maybe for last Christmas? These maps are all looking the same. I'm not crazy about this deals. Yep, he was up last Christmas. I knew it. I thought I saw him. That brought us all the way back here. But we don't have the green key yet. Green keys in here. Okay, let's just get to the green door now. Of course. By the way, Braxton, I really enjoyed watching you play Dusk. I wasn't sure about that game at first. 
but I, it's definitely on my wish list now. That's one I gotta play. I really like the atmosphere in that game and the way they kind of make you you feel like you're alone in that world. Just you and the enemies. You don't overdo it with the music and everything. It's it's such a good game. Eventually, I gotta pick it up. It's so much fun. Yeah, even just watching you play it was like a lot of fun. I really got into it. A lot of good retro boomer shooters. Modern retro. I guess we'll finish episode 3 next stream, but I'm gonna get out of here first. I'm not gonna end the stream without getting out of here. This is E4 M6, which means we have 7 and 8 left. We already did 9. 8 and 1. We ended up there by accident, excuse me. Completed it three times now. Nice. Ah, get out of here. That was so overwhelming. Do the right thing. I just teleported back to the beginning. No health. Blue door is right here. Let's go for it. Yeah, there's a couple of shooters out there I want to get. I still have a lot that I want to play. I think next time we pick a shooter, I'm gonna hold it up to a vote. A lot of good ones out there that are on my uh, backlog. Probably the only thing keeping me from picking up Dusk is the fact that I have so many on my backlog. Oh, uh, let's end this. We survived that. There was supposed to be some DLC for Iron Fury that was supposed to come out. I think it, I don't know if it was free DLC or you had to pay for it, but it was supposed to come out in spring and never did. Maybe it'll come out in fall. I liked Iron Fury. Um, Ion Fury. Is it the best game? No, but compared to the other revival shooters, probably not. It was solid. 
just didn't offer anything really new and intuitive. And I wish it would have expanded more on the story or, you know, cyberpunk elements. Good for what it was. Care. Kill him. The best FPS games of recent or medieval and thus yes, I remember watching you play medieval. This was definitely good. I mean, Blood Fresh Supply doesn't count. I, that's my favorite FPS, probably of all time. But it doesn't count because it's not really a recent game. It's just a re-release or a remaster. For me, at least, that, that way. And... A Medieval and Dusk are two games I haven't played yet. Soon, one day, I'll get to them. I gotta get through Hexen first. If I could compare the two. Compare with a Medieval. Blood is definitely a good one, but yeah, the remaster doesn't count. No, it doesn't. There's also a head-on. I never played head-on. Or Heenan, or whatever they call it. is back this way. And I missed that. Wrong way. On that side. Hold on a second. There's a door in there, and it's the blue door, I think. 
I gotta get to it from the other side. There we go. Two switches. What? I don't know. Okay, I think I see where we need to go now. This way. Right? On back here? Up there, there's like... Two routes we missed in the upper right hand corner. Get there. This way, we go that way, and there's two gates here that aren't open. We can go through. Enemies in there, maybe. Go into the lava. Thinking maybe there's a switch. Of course not. But how do we get out of here now? Is an area past that yellow door? No, we went through there. It's gotta be through the blue door. Usually where the exits are. Seriously. Go back the way we came, try to find the blue door. I think I was supposed to go that way. because we just came from there. There's either a switch that's supposed to open up those gates down there, or gates are meaningless. back through the blue. Can't think of anywhere else to go. Like it might be the end right there, which I just screwed up. Could have gone that way. All right, we're almost 
almost out of here. And all out of night. Really haven't had much sleep the last three days. I'm working from home tomorrow, thankfully. Thank you. We're out. Nice. Okay, so that's it for this. Start the next Ramparts of Perdition. Let's start this just so we can save it. And we'll pick up where we left off. This is map three. Oh, four seven. Okay, so we have one more map after this, and then we're going to start episode five. So I will be streaming on Thursday night. Thank you for hanging out, guys. Braxton, Zero Dine, Synergy. Glad to see you. Hope you feel better soon. Have a good night, guys. We are going to stream Thursday at 8.30. And maybe Sunday. And then that's it. That's it for a month. For several weeks. I'm actually going to start packing tomorrow. Got to start putting things away. I just have too much. where I'm going to store all this stuff, but... Alright, let's see who's online. Good night, guys. I'll be watching streams tomorrow, because if you guys are streaming, I'll stop by. Depends on how bad work gets, but... Who's online? Playing? Peebs. Let's raid Peebs. He's got 60 SNES games left. He's playing War 30 10. His goal has been to finish all SNES games. Seven year journey to get to 60 games. Let's raid him. Hey guys.